Hello, and welcome back to Zoo Tycoon. My name is Megan, and today we are just continuing to build. As always, uh, last episode we built the Okapi exhibit right here, and they're doing great. It's actually still fairly popular. We're up to five stars. I never would have believed that. I think I want to add some little topiaries back here just to fill it up and then I think I want to go ahead and add in some giraffes I'm thinking um, okapis are considered the forest giraffe or the zebra giraffe so I, I like to put them in but I don't know how I'm gonna fit them. I could just make a path go down here and then have some viewing areas on either side. One for an exhibit here and one for an exhibit here. Go ahead and try that. So where do I want the giraffes. That would be a better spot for them. So what what do we want here? I think that's too small for two of them. They kind of like their space. Flamingos, they need a ton of them in there to be happy. This can go away now. It's been a while since I built there. I don't think I want to do another cat right next to the cat. Let's let's break it up a little bit. I don't think I've ever put wildebeests in my zoo. Like maybe once or twice, but I'm always intimidated by how many they need to be happy. It says large herds. This says huge herds. They're big. Why don't we try it out? Mm, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Okay, so it would be 16 by 80. See, if I do them, I don't want to take any space away from this exhibit by by building a viewing area in. What did we say? It was eight? Maybe I'll do something different. Maybe I will just have it go in a little bit. Just one instead of two that they can then walk on. I don't think I'm going to put up observation areas. Just have it be like a sitting area, but not the whole way. Are we going in or out? We're going in. And then, just like that. I'm gonna use that. Was this dirt over here? Oh, that's board ball. Five, that's perfect. Gabby has given birth. I still don't know what the heck I'm gonna name her. Oh, yes I do, Gina. That's a name that I thought of. Okay. Gina. Oh, I'm glad I said Earl, I didn't even look before I made the executive decision on that name. Okay, so some beautiful flowers. And pick a fence. And then we're gonna do two. So I guess I should have more picket fence because that looks silly. And then the exhibit sign. Like that. 
Billie Jean has given birth. All right. A girl. Barbara. Barbara the bongo. We seem to be making a steady income. So I'm going to go ahead and up that to max. And we're going to go ahead. We can do the giant pandas. I'm going to also go ahead and get some dinosaur foliage since... Regular animals appreciate that. I don't think I need any of this. Nope. Okay. So we're doing wildebeests, right? I might have to move them in the future. I don't know how many it's going to take to make them happy. And we don't want the black buck, because that's Asia. Wildebeest, sorry, warthogs are just little rabbits. Breed like crazy. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna delve in. I'm gonna I'm gonna jump in. I'm on board with the wildebeests. I feel like they're gonna want a lot of dirt. Your favorite tree is also just the tall grass. So... Put some up close so they can see it. I'm gonna throw in one tree. We're gonna put the water up there. Whoa. I'm gonna slap on some dirt by that. And we're also going to get a little bush. Let's see, one, two, one, two. So I'm going to do that there. It really should be the other way around. That there. That there. Let's see what they think. Not enough dirt, too much savanna grass. They make weird sounds, yeah, I don't think I've ever used them before. Too much savanna, not enough sand. Oop. Large amount of foliage. Come on now. Happy? Sad. Sad. Happy. Okay. Can I squeeze one more in? Meh. They're, they're not loving it. They'll, they'll tolerate it. Too much dirt now. Not enough shelters. I'm going to go ahead and just throw in a large wood shelter because they're going to need it. And then more rocks. Oh god, okay. Jeez. <sighs> Come on now. That's the sound that zebras make. You're not gonna make that sound. No, sad. Nope. Alright, so I'll give you one more. I'll give you another lady. Gabby! Alright, so all of our original gazelles are kaput. They're gone. Now we've got George, Gabriella, and Gina. Gina's still a baby. Who had given birth to Gina? I think it was Gabriella. Billy Jean. No, Gabby. Gina's without her mama. 
All right, so we got Wilma. Wilma. Walter. And Wendy. First three names that came to me. That didn't take too long, actually. And we can now afford to have a zookeeper for everyone, I think. Let's see. Okay, so you're gonna just be the gazelle keeper. Perfect. And then next one down, we're gonna have be the bongo keeper. And then next one down, it's gonna be leopard. And the opine. Oops. Do that all the time. And then we gotta get one for the oak bees and one for the wildebeest. So you are the oak keeper. Oak copy? Is that how people say it? Oak copy. That's how I say it. And then the wild e. Wild e beast, isn't it? Oh, I renamed them. Wild E Beast. Yep. Wild E Beast. Keeper. And are all of these assigned now? Perfect. Are we getting a lot of trash around the jaunt? You might need a partner. You're going to fix that fence. Let me help you out. Now you're just monitoring zoo. Hmm. I guess I could add more trash cans subtly around. I don't want to add a lot. How does that look? Oops. Nah, who wants to sit next to our trash can? Betty can't find any food. Where are you? I know you're new to the job, but that means that you should be... Stepping it up. Don't slack on your first day. Can you just place it where I set you? Good gosh. Oh, somebody else was just placing it. Who are you? Weren't they eating? Woo! Ten more grand. Opal's given birth. Olivia. Aww. So cute. Oh, there's not enough shelters in here. Okay, there's food right over here. Weren't they eating grass and branches earlier? Or was that just the old copies? Okay, come on now. Check yourself, man. Okay, I think I put foliage all around it. Of course I did. So, I think we can get away with just getting rid of that one, which they apparently wanted me to anyways. There you go. You can't find any- it's right over here. Just go eat it. Wilma has given birth already. Ugh. Look at them, they're not even cute. Winifred? Winnie? Am I gonna confuse that with Winnie the Pooh? I guess let's do Winifred. That's not how you spell that. Winifred? Winefred. <laughs> okay, we're going with Winnie. 
Oh my goodness. Wow. You getting any more popular for me? You're at a solid one star. Still five. Oh, you're down a slot. That <laughs> baby is not popular. Alright, we've got 18 animals. One of them is hungry. And it's not even any of the bongos who are complaining about not being able to find food. It's Lenny over here. You're gonna eat anyways, so you're fine. Let's check on guests. There's a few that are hungry, so I could probably put in... Who is it? Where are you going? I don't know if they're headed... Well, that one's certainly not. I don't know if that one's headed to the restaurant. Let me put pop you in front of the... Where are you going? It's right there. What you doing? You're just gonna go sit down for a little bit. You're not even eating anything. You're just resting. Yeah, now you're hungry and thirsty. Will you just... Come on, you were green for a second. Yeah, go in there. Okay. Alright, I don't want these episodes going on too long. But I feel like we didn't do very much. It didn't take very long to get this done. I could probably build another one. Or at least decide what I want to build. That's going to continue down there. We could probably put in a... No. No, I want to... And then we got... Okay, sorry. One, two, three, four, five. That lines up pretty well, and then it'll jut out there. Are we going in or out? We're going in. And I guess this will be a big exhibit. Oh, I did- didn't I say I wanted to put giraffes in here? Seems to be decently sized. How big is it? So that's ten, so they can see the whole way back if they're sitting there. But no way. Hmm. So let's have it go in a little bit, right right at the same spot. One, two, three, four. I can't do math. Because I want it to be three. So yeah, that'll be three. And then that'll be more in the center. We can do one, two, three. One, two, three, and then down. And this is now 110, so they can't quite see. And they can't quite see over here, so we can put the shelter over here. Since the animals will want a bit of privacy anyways. What you doing? There's nothing to see here yet. Um, just gonna put that over here. And then I'm gonna get my red flowers. Okay. Yeah, that was- the panda was the last thing to research. Now we're getting some dinosaur plants. And learn all about giraffes from these beautiful signs. I did put some over there. And then observation areas. Oh, this is what I was talking about. 
a while ago. These are my favorite observation areas. One of my favorites because they go really well. They don't go perfectly with this fence. They go really well with it because it has that same kind of bar at the top. But it's clearly designed for dinosaurs because of the, the yellow tape on it. But I just like the way it looks and I wish it didn't have that yellow tape on it so I could use it everywhere. I also like that it's it's like curved and I just should use it more often. Where's my observation area? I'm scrolling too fast. There it is. Alright. So I'm going to build up this seating area and then I think I'm going to call it a a day. Because I don't want to get, to get too long and tedious. Do you have any thoughts on the length of the video you want? Please let me know because I'm kind of just winging it. Nice, beautiful. Alright, see, so this is a good spot to end. We, we already have more money than when we started and it's only been seven months. Um, Again, we're now making about 14 grand a month, even if I am building. We're getting a good chunk from the compost building. I don't know what I destroyed over here to get double that. Um, we're only making about three grand, two grand a month from admissions. Oh, you know why we got so much this month? I think that's when Olivia was born. I think that's when the endangered animals popped out a baby. So we got 10 grand for that. And I think this is just because people like our zoo. I'm going to go ahead and up that now since we got money to burn. I'm also going to up the admissions to 25. I would never pay $25 to come into the zoo. There is not enough for me to see for it to be worth $25. Alright, well here we are. We're going to build giraffes next episode. And then, I don't know if I want to keep expanding this way. Or if I should start building over here. I know I want to build a little bit of a food court somewhere. Probably over here is fine. Because it's right when you walk in. It's right as you're leaving. So that'll be good. Let me know what you think, if you have any suggestions. Again, I'm always taking suggestions for names. I'm running out of G names. I'm going to quickly run out of O names. And if these guys keep having babies as fast as they are, I'm going to need a lot of W names. But thanks so much for watching. Thanks for tuning in. And have a great day.